Welcome, loyal subscribers to the Butterbean channel. Uh, today is a special, special uh, video. Hopefully I will not be bothered by Haley or Jen throughout the entirety of this video, uh, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, I received my second bespoke box today. Now, in the first one, there was the Field Guide to Whiskey. Pretty cool. Lots of stuff about whiskey in here, you know. Pictures of whiskey, facts about whiskey, stuff that looks like whiskey. Really cool. Also came with these glasses, which I'm currently drinking, an old fashioned out of. You'll also note that I'm going to open my bespoke box with my sweet uh, Pit Boy carbon steel, Damascus steel knife. So, here we go. Uh, if anybody wants to watch this, I'm opening the box right now. I'm going to cut this away from me so as to not be sliced open. Really? Yes. Now you ruined my video! The viewers want more Haley. They want actually way less Haley. I've lost subscribers because of you. Slicing. Oh, I'm ripping now. Put down the knife. Nope, I'm not. Back up again. I didn't open that nearly as quick as Chris does on the Bob Park Buzzing channel. Uh, by the way, last month, like I said, was a whiskey based box called Dram. This one is a beer based box. We've got the Beer Makers Kit. Get that out of here. Get those cats will run like wild. I went with the blonde flavor. You could either get the IPA, which nobody likes because it's way too healthy, or you could go with the blonde. Another sip of the What do you do laughing at down there? You and your viewers. So, let's see what we got here. It's inside the Brooklyn Brew Shop beer making kit. Let's see. First, we've got. Some sort of description between pints, stemmed glasses, pilsners, and mugs. You'll see here on this handy card for a future reference. Mm -hmm. see. This appears to be some form of accoutrement. There's some. Um, I wonder if that is yeast. Some you know other sort of thing. Oh no. Here's the yeast. Falconers, light hops. Oh, look at this. Little bottle caps. They must have given me little bottles. How jealous are you guys about my bottle caps? That's cool. You're damn right it's cool. Uh, this was, it listed this. I don't know. Oh, this is the bottle capper. They so must put that on and then thwack! And then bottle caps. Mm. Uh, so this is some thing. Sorry. That's wrapped. Oh, it's a thermometer. Maybe I can use this to check to see if I have COVID. <laughs> Which, by the way, is fake. Um, let's see. Pull out the big part. Oh my, look what we've got here. Mm. This is your beer making mix right yonder. It's malt, probably. Excuse me, are you on screen? You don't talk if you're, on, if you're off screen. I'll teach you salad, okay, Cupid doll? It's malt or whey. <laughs> it's not whey, okay? It's not curds and whey. This is Nitsy Bitsy Spider. Right, this is some sort of curved plastic thing. And look what we've got here. The Growler. Ooh, really One full gallon, baby. Read it and weep. And then we've got some other curled up tubing. It looks like Richard Crocker used right before he died. Um, that's everything inside the box. I'm hoping that there are some sort of instructions which I didn't see. Are they all? They're on the back of the box, or on the back of that paper with the beers? Huh. And uh, oh, there it is. 
how to brew. I noticed it on the back of the box. <laughs> Nobody off screen oh. who was all sassy and annoying noticed it. Oh, yeah. She's, she's coming Looks like what you got to do is you make the mash, then the sparge, then the boil, ferment, bottle, drink and enjoy, which Butterbean will do. Very simple. So, on that note, I'm going to drink a little bit more of my old fashioned. Mm -hmm. I'm going to take you on a quick tour to see the amazing chili that I have cooking tonight. There's Haley and Jen. Ugh. Behind the scenes. No. Here's some biscuits that I made this evening. Here is the chili that is currently burrowing. Let's see what's happening here. I'm going to stir this around a bit. Still trying to get it to steam down a bit, you know. Butterbean likes his chili thick, and he likes hot butter on his breakfast toast. In case you were wondering if I ever happen to, you know, sleep over at your house and you want to make me breakfast toast. Make sure that the butter's hot. Um, hmm. I believe that's all. Oh, in the previous box, by the way, I also got these bitters, which I'm currently using in my old fashioned. Oh, and I got some ice, uh, the ability to make ice balls. Uh, Settle down. Ice in the shape of a ball. You get what I'm saying. Anyway, um, I believe that's all. It's been wonderful seeing you all. And uh, don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe. Butterbean out.